Some of the most skilled hunters are flying around in the sky, just waiting to take off with their prey clenching their talons. Remember, birds are closely related to dinosaurs, which were also pretty dangerous during the Jurassic era. Other birds have extremely powerful legs, which can deliver kicks like we've never seen before. From some birds with devastating pecs, to birds you don't want to mess with at the park, here are 12 most dangerous birds. Hey guys, this is American Eye, bringing you another great video. Number 12. Dalmatian Pelicans Dalmatians are some of the largest flying birds out there and are known for being able to scoop up fish with its basket-like jaw. One of the most massive birds out there is the Dalmatian Pelican, and you better believe they have some massive eggs as well. The eggs can weigh about 6 ounces. That's some serious protein, guys. Some specimens have weighed in at 23 pounds with an 8-foot wingspan. They're certainly not afraid to put up a fight either, and with a beak like that, you better watch out. Their numbers have declined quite a bit in recent years, but they're still found in India and China. They're native to areas around the Danube River in Eastern Europe and are believed to be some of the heaviest native birds in Europe. Sometimes while standing, they can reach heights of 5 foot 3 to 6 feet. They typically breed around water and will choose islands for nesting. Predators such as jackals and wolves have been known to raid their nesting settlements, which certainly doesn't help them preserve. Number 11. Ostriches Do you think owning an ostrich farm seems like a fun idea? This is the largest species of bird, and they have been known to wreak havoc upon unsuspecting people. Being the largest species of bird at 6.9 to 9.2 feet tall and weighing an average of 230 pounds, they also have the largest eggs of the bird kingdom. You could probably get injured just by getting hit with one of their eggs. They set the record in 2008 for a confirmed egg weighing in at 5 pounds and 11 ounces. Some estimate that this egg could cost up to $40,000. Another fascinating large species of flightless bird, ostriches have extremely powerful legs which can easily knock you out with one good kick. Many believe that ostriches are close relatives to dinosaurs but gave up on flying once the dinosaurs were extinct. Researchers claim that since they lost a large amount of their predators, they simply became fat and lazy because they no longer had a reason to fly. Number 10. Seagulls they might look innocent and harmless on the outside, but seagulls are known to get aggressive and you might want to finish off those crumbs from the Doritos you brought with you to the beach. Seagulls can and will go after you if you're too close to their nest, which could be just about anywhere in the sand. In 2006, someone actually had to go to the emergency room after getting relentlessly pecked. Her wounds were actually as deep as the seagull's beak is long. That's some serious pecking power. We should also probably add that some of those wounds were to the head. Stay vigilant, folks, and don't feed the seagulls, because they'll come back wanting more. Number 9. The Greater Rhea They might seem calm as you're watching them from afar, but get too close and you'll regret it. Just one kick with its powerful legs could be enough to be fatal. Sometimes their claws can even be 6 inches long. It makes sense that a large number of the biggest birds on Earth are going to be flightless birds. It's just simple aerodynamics. The greater rhea is found in South America in countries such as Argentina, Bolivia, Brazil, Paraguay, and Uruguay. However, recently it's been able to reproduce in Germany and revive the number of the species. Although it doesn't really seem like it should belong in Germany, they manage to do fairly well and are even making up part of the habitat here. The massive birds can weigh up to 60 pounds and be as tall as 5 feet, so you better watch out. Number 8. Southern Cassowary Another flightless bird, the cassowary, is native to the tropical areas in northern Australia, parts of Borneo, and you may have encountered this bird on Rook Island in Farkai 3. These were once traded as a valuable commodity and their leather was used for various reasons. They've often been spotted with yellow or multicolored necks and are known to attack people when approached. They have very sharp claws on their toes as you can tell from this photo. They can jump up to a meter in the air and will aim for the throat with their claws. Southern cassowaries will basically put their head down and run at you at full speed with a thick helmet of skin on their head. They use this extra layer of skin on their head to guide themselves through dense forests without looking. But they also might charge at you at full force with their head down. You don't have to worry about it too much since there are only about 2,000 cassowaries left and they're slowly becoming extinct. Number 7. Vultures If the zombie apocalypse were to strike, you can definitely imagine that vultures will be flying around the skies. Don't think for a minute that a vulture is too scared to swoop down and snatch your kid. These animals have built up strong immunities to many different diseases and defend themselves against a wide variety of pathogens. 
This is due to the strong gastric acids found in their stomach that are much stronger than birds like eagles for example. Their sharp claws have been known to injure people while they're just walking around. This ultimate scavenger will be having an all-you-can-eat buffet during many apocalypse scenarios. Number 6. Birds at Airports now here's a different way birds can be dangerous to humans you probably didn't know about. There isn't a ton of details about this photo, but it appears to have been taken in the mid-2000s. The birds are completely flocking to this plane, literally. Pilots do become accustomed to having to deal with birds, but this many all in one location is quite rare. Pilots often refer to colliding with birds as a bird hit or a bird bash, and this is a significant flying hazard. Birds can either get sucked into the engine or just collide into the windshield. It's estimated that this can cause $400 million worth of damage each year. But you'd really be surprised how many times this has led to fatal plane crashes, and they've even caused notable damage on spacecraft as well. Number 5. The Andean Condor This massive New World Vulture is found in the Andes Mountains and flying around the Pacific coastlines in South America. It's the largest flying bird in the world, going by its wingspan and weight. It can easily lift a small mammal from the sky. Its maximum wingspan can reach nearly 11 feet long, and only a few seabirds have a wider wingspan. This bird is considered to be a scavenger and will basically eat what's left over of diseased animals. It's the only bird of prey where the male is actually larger than the female. Their nests are normally high up in the Andes Mountains at an average elevation of 16,000 feet. Luckily, people aren't found around this bird too often or may decide to go after them. Captive breeding programs have kept this bird from becoming threatened, and thankfully, due to their isolation at high elevations, they're able to stay alive. The Andean condor has also become the national bird of quite a few South American countries and has also played a role in mythology of the indigenous religions. Number 4. Mute Swan Mute swans are swans that are generally less vocal and appear primarily in Europe, Japan, and the eastern United States. This is the largest species of swan and it's also the most dangerous. Its most recognizable attribute would be the little fleshy knob atop its beak, which is normally larger for males. They can reach heights of 5 feet and have pure white feathers, except for the little part of black on the top of their beak. There's a population of about 500 mute swans after breeding season, which doesn't make it too endangered but their numbers have tended to decline in many places around the world. They generally inhabit in former Soviet Union countries, where about 70% live. The mute swan was introduced to North America in the late 19th century, where their numbers rapidly increased to the point where they were considered an invasive species. This guy here we see in the photo got a little bit too close to a mute swan and got bit right in the nose. Number 3. Birds with Avian Influenza also known as the bird flu, this disease is caused by viruses that naturally occur among wild aquatic birds worldwide and can affect domestic poultry and animal species, according to the Center of Disease Control and Prevention. This can occur from birds directly or from an area contaminated with the virus. Once this spreads to a host, it can become very contagious. This form of influenza has been known to infect ducks, chickens, pigs, whales, horses, and even humans. What makes this disease especially deadly is that it can cross over from different species. For example, one case states that a virus had infected a group of pigs in the US, then it spread over to a group of horses there. Symptoms in humans of this pathogen can include fever, cough, sore throat, and muscle aches. A highly infected person can suffer from severe respiratory illnesses like difficulty breathing and viral pneumonia. When it gets worse, it can mentally alter us, causing seizures and a change in mental status. Number 2. European Herring Gull As we mentioned before, mama birds do get aggressive when it comes to protecting their young, but some will be even more dangerous. Let's take the European Herring Gull for example. Weighing in at just 3 pounds, but with a wingspan of 6 feet, this bird definitely is something you don't want to underestimate and they've been known to be lethal. They can inflict serious injury with their sharp claws during nesting season and will even try to fight your dog. A man even suffered a heart attack when he was completely swarmed by the birds in 2002. Their beaks are sharp enough to break through crab shell, so these guys can definitely do some damage. And number 1. Golden Eagle This amazing species of bird has been trained by hunters to take down large mammals using nothing but their hunting skills and sharp talons. Animals such as rabbits and other rodents are some of its typical prey, but this eagle isn't afraid to go after big meals. Some of their larger prey includes foxes, deer, wolves, and livestock. Farmers have reported some eagles as being nuisances due to the fact that they've been snatching their livestock. Those who have managed to train the eagles are always impressed with their hunting instincts that seem to come so naturally. They can spot their prey from miles away, and they know that attacking from the sky has its advantages. 
They've even used tactics such as pushing animals off cliffs in order to get their next meal. Their claws are designed to be 10 times as powerful as humans, and they can do some serious lifting. Normally though, a sharp talon to the throat will do the job, and once the animal is mobilized, it's game over.